What's up, good people? Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Blue Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. Tell you what, that didn't take long. Dan freaking Quinn. I, I'm, I'm just... I'm, I'm just like, I, I, you know, we all want blood. It was so freaking ugly. So freaking ugly watching the Cowboys game that literally I feel sick to my stomach. And the defense, how are you going to give up 48 points at home? Well, excuse me, 42 points. Uh, we'll, 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 we'll give seven of that to Dak. He's got his own issues too. But that team did not look like they were prepared. And um, Dan Quinn, today is Monday. We're not even 24 hours away from kickoff of the game yesterday. Not the final, the kickoff. It hadn't even kicked off. He already has four interviews scheduled for this week. Four. Commanders, Chargers, Panthers, and Titans. Four interviews set up this week. So, uh, at this point... At this point, you might as well say that dude is gone. You you need to be gone, okay? Because and, and I'm sitting here. If I'm 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 one of these teams right now, and I'm looking at I'm looking at this and wondering, is Dan Quinn as good as we think he is? Because in the games that mattered the most, the Cowboys defense didn't show up at all. Buffalo playoffs. And um, 49ers, it's not showing up. So I, I don't know. I, 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 I I'm reevaluating this right now and wondering. And, and maybe, and, and it may be time that you know, the, the thing. Here's the thing that happens, to coaches. You usually get five years. If you haven't won anything in five years, then it's time to move on, because that's usually enough time for you to implement your system and get the players that you need for that system. And usually, if you don't win in five years, you're not going to. Now, Mike McCarthy has been here four years, and it's crazy to think that here we are, three years of 12-win seasons. No team has gone and won 36 games over a three-year span and not been in the NFC or AFC Championship game. Cowboys always find the records to break. They always do. Dan Quinn was exactly what the team needed after Mike Nolan. He was a breath of fresh air. He came in. He changed the narrative and stuff. But I think, unfortunately, the problem for us is always great regular season team. But when the playoffs happen, we're not there. And see, playoffs change the dynamics. Playoffs are more cold weather, running the football, ball control. And the way our defense has been designed, which has been remarkable, is about getting after the quarterback. You look at Micah Parsons. Micah Parsons is an absolute beast at tracking down and getting to the quarterback. But when you have teams that can run the football, the problem is, is they believe in fast and physical. The problem with fast and physical is Generally speaking, they're longer guys, they're taller guys, and they're skinnier guys. And when you have people that are tall and you're playing defensive line, you've got a higher center of gravity. But see, this is where sometimes you just need a fire hydrant. And if you've ever backed up into a fire hydrant with your car or truck, it's an immovable force. It's low to the ground. It's solid. But if you've ever hit a telephone pole that's tall, right? It's tall. You hit that sucker, it just kind of goes down. And that's the difference on this defense. That is the tragic flaw. If your team has got a lead and they're, you know, the other team is trying to chase you, it's great because you're just chasing the quarterback. But we can't stop the run. And that is the problem we've had forever. And that's where you need a different type of guy. You need a big, immovable force. Not just Hankins. You need like three Hankins there in the middle that can just drop an anchor and say, you're not running up the middle on us. 
I am so flustered and so sick right now and disgusted with what happened. I'm still a diehard Dallas Cowboy fan, and I feel like they're making me die real hard right now. Hope you guys are coping better than I am. Um, Dan Quinn, I wish you the best of luck. Um, I think right now, if for nothing else, the Cowboys need change for change's sake. And maybe we do need somebody like Bill Belichick. The problem with Bill Belichick is, is he is like Bill Parcells, and he's not going to want to have the Will McClay and the uh, Stephen Jones picking the players and in his shit. He's going to want to have full control over the team. Now, you can look at Bill Belichick and say he's screwed the pooch when it's come to quarterbacks uh, recently, but at least you can look and say you got a quarterback in place, and maybe he can do something with this defense and make it better. Mike McCarthy is probably dead man walking. Dead man walking. Let me ask you, honey. What is the fix for my Cowboys? Is it Jerry Jones? Is that the problem? That's the one thing we have not changed in all those years is Jerry freaking Jones. All right, good people. I'm going to be live streaming the game, games. I know it's going to be the walk of shame for me that everybody's going to troll the hell out of me. Before I do, I'm going to make some chicken broth for my lovely bride here. Make some soup because it's cold. I can't, see, I, I can't seem to get anything right today. I, I, but too close to that. Now this car is trying to back out. Go ahead. Are you backing out or not backing out? Go ahead. Go ahead. Whew. Well, one good thing about having the red brick house, when it snows, I get the store right across the street. So, it's all to park in. Huh? Like try to park in. I was trying not to walk, to walk across the grass since yeah. we were coming back. Really? Let me just go home. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I'll just take her home and walk across the street. That's shit. No, no, no. Just go park it. I'm so confused today. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. My cowboy stink. Chicken and get cooking. 